we know what needs to be done. We want to create a safe, livable community where we can walk, play, and work without fear, without loss, without accepting loss, less than we deserve as Newton residents. Earlier this year, in a venue that was too small to accommodate the outpouring of support, the Newton Community Association held a public forum to address safety concerns following the violent death of hockey mom Julie Pascal in the area. A secondary forum has been scheduled in a much larger venue to ensure this time that all voices are heard. In Newton, 49 police officers redeployed, bike patrols, additional CCTV cameras, community policing office, extended hours, all of that's done, all of it's implemented. If I might, I might introduce uh, Sergeant Mark Searle, your new district commander in Newton. For me, it was loud and clear how much people care, and sometimes when you're in a position that I'm in, uh, information gets filtered, and the great thing about coming to a place like this is you get it in its rawest, purest form. It's of tremendous value to me. It's always good to ask people to come together, express their ideas, and cooperate with each other. The response from officials at the latest meeting indicate that a unified voice from the Newton community is resulting in positive changes for their neighbourhood. I'm Dean Atwell for Joy TV News.